The Theory of the Leisure Class by Thorstein Blunt. Thorstein Blunt's The Theory of the Leisure Class is a classic work of sociology and economics, published in 1899. The book argues that the leisure class, which is composed of the wealthiest members of society, engages in conspicuous consumption and waste in order to signal their status to others. Blunt coined the term conspicuous consumption to describe this behavior, which he saw as a form of waste that served no practical purpose. He also argued that the leisure class engages in conspicuous leisure, or the display of wealth and status through the performance of non-productive activities, such as hunting and sports. Vlun argued that this behavior is not only wasteful, but also harmful to society, as it creates a culture of emulation and competition that can lead to economic and social inequality. He also criticized the idea of the trickle-down effect, which suggests that the wealth and benefits of the leisure class will eventually trickle down to the rest of society. Instead, Vlun argued that the leisure class serves primarily to maintain and reinforce their own status, rather than benefiting society as a whole. He also analyzed the role of technology and industrialization in shaping society, and argued that these forces can either promote or hinder the development of a more equal and efficient economic system. Vlun's work had a significant influence on the development of sociology and economics, and remains an important critique of the excesses and inequalities of modern capitalism. Overall, the theory of the leisure class is a thought-provoking and insightful analysis of the cultural and economic forces that shape modern society, and remains a relevant and influential work over a century after its initial publication. Like and subscribe for more content.